Hey guys, I just want to give a quick update of my game and I'm just going to play it for a bit just to show you where it's at right now. So I'm going to start by spawning in some little guys and I haven't got any wood so I'll start by harvesting some wood and adding some cows in there and now that they've got three wood I can build a little house and in this update I've just added some farms in there, which they'll uh, get going and then those farms will just grow some food over time and uh, another thing that I added um, is just the ability to generate mana with churches so if you extend this building it becomes a church like that so the buildings have two functions they uh, serve as the center for farms to form and also for uh, churches and the churches only generate mana when there's actually people inside them and they go inside them at night when they want to sleep and they also breed when they're in them so they have multiple purposes right now i'm going to separate them later um, but as you can see the light is changing now, I've got a day-night cycle and uh, it's a little bit too dark and too red but I'll change it uh, and also the building sprites stand out and I need to just erase the edges this is the first sprite that I made for the houses actually I haven't changed it but I, I also changed the lighthouse to more of a church thing there's some I have to uh, update some of these graphics. I didn't import them correctly, but anyway, that's for later. Oh, and debug mode is on for the babies, so the babies will uh, make the trees flash if they're going to go harvest them. Oh, and yeah, there's babies now. So that's something new. Uh, I've got 91 mana, so my mana has been increasing, and the food problem is solved because they've got uh, farms, so I don't need to keep supplying them with cows all the time. And this little baby is going to go work the fields over here. Uh, yeah, you see this graphic is blurry because I didn't import it correctly. That's just a very quick fix. Um, got 93 mana. I would like them to generate more mana if possible. So maybe if I this is red because somebody's going to go uh, work the fields and that's just because of uh, debug mode. Uh, I've almost got, okay, so I've got a hundred mana now, so now I can build a bridge over here which also grows some trees. Um, and that's the most expensive thing, other than this which costs a thousand and that's to uh, show more of the map. Uh, so I've got seven wood now, so I can uh, make this a bit bigger. So it's actually a game now, like I can actually play for an extended amount of time without um, having to restart everything. Uh, so yeah, I'll just play for a bit and see what happens. I've got lots of food, actually way too much food. So let me, uh, let me colonize another area here. more wood so the wood is the the scarce resource at the moment and there's no way to generate wood except by making land so I'm gonna make a uh, a water miracle oh and it's morning time now um, they do uh, sleep at night but they'll wake up if their energy uh, if they get enough energy but they do tend to wake up during the day and sleep at night so these guys have nothing to do, let me uh, put a plonk a farm down here and some trees. So it's basically like populous at the moment, very much like populous actually. And that's where I've got most of my inspiration from. This is uh, black and white and Lionhead games, Peter Molyneux. I should have put this on the side. So that I could have made two. Uh, these are the only buildings that are useful now but you can build other kinds of buildings. Let me make this into a, uh, 
We used to call these lighthouses, but they're churches now. Um, too many churches, to be honest, but <laughs> I'll change the way that mana generates later in the game. A church will be like a, a special a special thing. Um, let's see, I don't know what will happen if I click here, but let's see. Oh, that's pretty cool. I'll build uh, another church. If, it should be that the higher you build, the more mana is generated. Uh, but there's no trees, so let me um, expand here. Yeah. These guys are just standing around. It's just a little family on the hill, hilltop farm. Uh, the manor is generating very nicely now, which is what I like to see. And I've got another, another chunk of wood. It takes three wood to build a house. And I can carry on expanding the land here. Uh, this is the first time I've played the game for this long without having to restart it. Uh, the thing that I just finished adding was the farms, which is why they look a bit weird, but um, should have made this video after fixing that, but oh well, I don't feel like making another one. Um, lots of food, so let me just uh, create some more dudes. Might as well. Oh, creating guys also costs mana. Should know that I did design the game. Uh, need more trees. I'm gonna run out of trees, and then it's just a waiting game after that. So um, yeah, I think the next thing I need to add to make the game play better is water miracles. But there's a lot of other things that I want to move my attention to first. There's supposed to be stars in the background, and I don't know why they aren't right now. I think I've got the timing of the stars wrong. I'm just waiting for the mana to reach 100 because I quite like uh, changing the landscape. It's quite fun. It's a little bit too expensive at the moment, but um, all, all everything's going to be rebalanced. It's also like the only way to generate trees right now is to change the land. I should, the trees should also grow naturally, I think. Uh, yeah, well, it's a lot of things to think about. Got a lot of wood, so let me build something cool. If I place one here, we should get a clothesline. Yeah, there we go. Clothesline doesn't do anything, it just it just looks kinda cool. Um There's more space for a farm over there. See that means that they're gonna go build a farm. Jeez, there's a lot of kids now. <laughs> Got a bit of a population issue, but it's not an issue because I have so much food. Lots of mana, so let's expand, expand, expand. I haven't got a way to to traverse slopes yet, but I'll I'll add that like last I think because I'm not interested. Uh, okay, I've got lots of trees now. Okay, so it reaches a point where you just uh, trees come easy. Oh, I'm running into a lot of lag now. That's a lot of. It's just too many babies. Okay, so lag stopped. Lots of lag. Lots of lag. Yeah, there's just too many babies being produced now. Look at my food. It's just going down. But uh, wow, it's a real uh, who's who here. Okay, I can't even move the mouse anymore. Let me build a block up here. I'll just put like another island up here. Oh. <laughs> uh, if the food reaches zero, they'll naturally starve to death. But then it'll ba it'll start balancing out. But it's it, there are too many people right now. Basically, uh, my computer's on fire. 
I'm gonna have to call the fire department. How are, who's down here? And how are they harvesting those trees? That's, that's a bug. That's clearly a bug. Jeez, but look at these guys. Holy moly. That's a lot of people. But I'm glad that it's at this level now where I can just sort of leave it and they, and they reproduce like this. It's quite funny, actually. I think the issue is that kids can reproduce and, they, and nobody dies of old age. So those are two things that I need to implement in order to solve this overpopulation issue. And then obviously put a population cap. Uh, and also uh, there should be a population cap naturally just from the buildings. Like they should only breed if there's enough space. But anyway, um, I'm going to clear up. So you can start a new game just by hitting this button here. And uh, that seemed to have cleared everything up. And then you use this button to generate a new land and now you can start all over again so yeah i guess the game's pretty stable if i can push it to that limit and still be playing but then i've got no mana so i just have to restart again uh, the best way to start out whoa this is a weird weird one best way to start out is just to start with two guys i think and then one house i haven't got wood uh, yeah to wait for them to harvest some wood but two guys just to save mana because once you got two they'll breed but I guess you have to wait until night time yeah just don't listen to me when the game comes comes out you'll get you can develop your own strategy anyway thank you very much for watching and uh, yeah if you if you want to support the game maybe become a, a tester you can just join my patreon and I'll put you on the testing list and uh, there's also uh, 3D models to buy, which will also contribute to the game. So thank you very much for watching and subscribe.